G'day, James Cullen from Stones Corner Marine, and today I want to show you over the CJ503 Territory, uh, and in particular, the Leisure Deck. The Leisure Deck is a new uh, option from the CJ Factory, which certainly adds a little bit of comfort, a little bit more family, to what's known as a, a very good fishing boat. Okay, the 503, just a couple of points I'll, I'll make. Uh, 90 horsepower is the maximum horsepower on this, and in this instance, we've got a Yamaha 90 horsepower four-stroke. It is the maximum power. Uh, I'd certainly be happy to own this boat with a 75, but for those people that are interested in water sports uh, and similar, the 90 horsepower gives that extra bit of uh, thrill in your day. Um, on the back of this boat, I'm just going to show you a couple of things. We've got the, the transom here. So the, this transom is all part of this Ultimate Edge uh, transom and it, it's fitted on the next gen uh, adrenaline hull. Now, basically you've got two duck boards, you've got a high back motor well. Uh, and, and that provides a full full height boat at transom, which provides uh, safety when in open or partially smooth waters. Round to the uh, port side of the boat, you'll find that CJ fit their um, Ultimate Edge transom here with a dive ladder. It's a two run dive ladder, easy to get your, your fins in and out of. It's also angled nicely, which makes launching uh, yourself up and down the ladder very easy. It's, it's not kicking under the boat like some ladders do. It's just an easy walk up ladder. So I'm going to jump on board, I'm going to show you through the inside of this boat, and in particular that Leisure Deck option. Alright, so firstly I'll just I'll, I'll stand here and I'll point out, that's the, the Leisure Deck uh, in its full, full course there. Uh, a full set of um, seating cushions, and also the uh, padded combings uh, around the edge. Um, now these sections are removable. Uh, in pieces so in the event that you are you know wanting to use this area as one large cast platform there's plenty of room on a full full height cast platform okay in saying that however in applications where there's family involved you know this centerpiece can be removed cushions can be positioned allowing a nice large seating pad with padded cone uh, behind your back to give a little bit of support. Certainly a great feature in my opinion for, for families with a couple of young kids um, where, where the kids can sit up here, ride in comfort, plenty of padding, they can have a bit of a lay down obviously in a, in a shaded afternoon, um, but at the same time not losing that fishing focus of the full cast platform. This boat is still fitted stand with the electric motor pad standard with a bow sprit and roller okay so none of the fishing attributes are lost in the leisure deck feature um, but the, the the benefit is as i said that family crossover market standard in the territory boat are your two two deluxe uh folding heavily padded wraparound support seats and and they certainly offer good comfort for mum and dad you'll also see this boat here we've fitted with a raised canvas uh, and marine bimini top they're locally made here in Brisbane and, and we've been supporting Ray and his business and he's been supporting us now for over a decade. Makes excellent quality uh, bimini tops. They're all made of three mil uh, bimini bows. We've got the forward bar, which means we can remove any, any interruption of rear straps at the back of the boat, opening the back of the boat up, up for fishing purposes. Just put these uh, pieces back in the puzzle. as easy as that. While we're here, we'll have a quick look at the, the side console. Side console offers a glove box storage, good for phone, wallet and keys. We've got a little Garmin combination unit fitted here on the dash. Uh, it is on a swivel, so it does allow for the flexibility of, of pivoting that unit. It's also on a tilt cradle. So there's plenty of uh, option there, depending on how that light's hitting that screen. But the two Yamaha 6x8 gauges, that includes your uh, your full fuel management system fitted and also the uh, switch panel. I think all in all, I think the uh, CJ Territory, as I said, is a very good crossover boat for family or fishermen. Um, as I sit here and still try to wrap up this video, I, I see other features I'll, and I'll point them out. The Territory is fitted with a Railblazer uh, horizontal rod storage. So the ability to get three rods stowed horizontally certainly gives um, uh, again, whether you've got family or fishermen, uh, a place to secure gear. And last of all, spin around, I should show you this. 
the CJ uh, removable bait board. So that's at a good height. So if I'm standing here now, trying to, trying to uh, fill it up some bait, um, certainly at a good height, good high walls. It's got a drain, it's got four rod holders and it is removable. And this option fitted here, again, a factory option, uh, is interchangeable with a drop-in ski pole. So if you're not into the fishing, and you're only into the leisure deck and, and the, the social boating with family, there is a drop-in ski pole uh, available for, for this boat when ordered as the, the bait board ski pole combination. Look, I'm gonna wrap it up there. There's more I could go on about, but I, I just wanted to give you a quick look at the CJ Territory fitted with the leisure deck. Thanks for watching.